Welcome back to Pop Star to Opera Star. Six pop stars so far have dived in at the operatic deep end. Now it's time for our seventh and final pop star to take the plunge. It's Jimmy Osmolo Osman. <laughs> Jimmy Osman, you're Jimmy Osmolo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad that's over. Jimmy, you got the top note. I'm so pleased. No, no. You need to sing through the phrases because you start the phrases in your opera voice and you finish them in your pop voice. Kind of mad at myself for a couple of things, but I'm glad I got through it. So your song for week two is Volare. Volare. We want Jimmy to sing this song in an operatic way just like the great Pavarotti. I love Volare. I saw it performed when I was a little boy, so it brings all my childhood back. This week, he needs to focus on singing in the opera voice all the way through to the ends of the lines. It's not good enough to sing the first few notes and then sing the end in the pop voice. I would sing, Volare, hey, how's your steak cooked? Versus, Volare, and finishing it properly. I think there's a huge danger for me always slipping back into the pop no matter what song I sing. But it's not just about losing the pop voice. Jimmy also has to find the mood of the song. This is quite a flirty song, so we need Jimmy to inject some passion. And we found the perfect woman for him to serenade, his wife. I was singing to her, and you know what you do? You forget all the mechanics and inhibitions when someone knows you as well as she does. When I watch Jimmy sing, it's so amazing, and I think it's sexy. <laughs> it come Friday night, my wife will be there, won't you? Yes. And I'll be singing to her, and hopefully I can re-enact this emotion from the inside out rather than making it forced. Penso canzogno così non ritorni mai più Mi ripingiavo le mani alla faccia del blu Voi nel previso venivo dal vento rapito E cominciavo a volare nel cielo infinito have performed so the phone lines are now open for you to vote for your favorite performance all the numbers are on our screen now but please do dial carefully remember you're voting for who you think should stay in the competition so Jimmy Volare, Volare. how was that for you I, mean, it I, was, I blew the words but I had so much fun <laughs> <laughs> so if I gotta go what a way to go right no, you you thought you'd get in there before they did there, didn't you? Did <laughs> I don't you? know. But it was so much fun. What a great song. What a great opportunity. Thank you so and much. And what, what about the opera sound? Are you still uh, figuring out how to, I'm still to get that on sound it. going into I was the just pop? thinking about my beautiful bride down there. Oh. The whole time. Oh. <laughs> 
Alan, let's see if his beautiful bride felt touched. Michelle, did it work for you this time? Was it all right? I thought it was fantastic. <laughs> you see, an impartial comment there from the wife. <laughs> Rolando, did you think it was fantastic? Well, I mean, <laughs> you said it. Uh, the words were not, were not there. And I think, and this is the problem of, you know, of opera singers, that the voice was a little tired. And yeah. I think you were nervous, and that's why the words were not there. Because yeah. immediately you started singing, and you went, oops, I, the voice is not quite there. So you were struggling it, but you tried very hard. You kind of went through it, and yeah. so it is like that. When the voice is tired, there's nothing else you can do. Can so, I do it again? <laughs> <laughs> so the words weren't there, and the voice wasn't terribly good. But apart from that meet, how did you yeah, enjoy well, it? Well, just let me tell you this. <clears throat> Jimmy, in the middle of that stage right there, I don't know, you did something with your hand, and it was sexy, dude. <laughs> it was sad, and if she wasn't here, I'd have you on the floor. Oh, oh my goodness. You know, I, I, never thought, I never thought I'd be worried about Meatloaf's sexuality, but <laughs> suddenly there was a free song in there, Lawrence. <laughs> um, well, last week, of course, you sold us ice cream, and I have to say that this week, I thought it was a bit of cheese. Very nice, Ooh. lovely, <laughs> but please, next week, no more Neapolitan stuff. Let's have opera, let's have tragedy, let's have degradation, death and a yeah. bit of lust. OK, <laughs> it's goodbye to the Bel Paisley. Thank you, panel. Yes. Molly. Right, funny games down there. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Jimmy Osmond. Thank you so much. Thank you. And if you think Jimmy did Pavarotti proud, then don't forget, lines are open for him and all of our stars. So, that's it. They've given their all. Now it's over to you. The five stars have